And today, one of the Grand Strand's biggest events is revving up in one of our smallest towns. Abigail Evans joins us live now in, in Atlantic Beach, showing us the preps going into Bike Fest with a brand new police chief at the helm. Michaela, good morning. Darion, good morning. Interim Police Chief Carlos Castillo took over last month when Horry County Police arrested Quentin Robinson during a prostitution sting. He says despite the quick rise to power, he's ready. We have officers all all over every corner, all areas. We'll be uh, well prepared for anything and, and making sure the public and the residents here are safe. North Myrtle Beach anticipates 100,000 tourists will be in town this weekend, so their officers and sled agents are just some of the few pouring in to help. Casillo tells me he's added streetlights around town so officers can catch a glimpse of everything. He also wants to remind you to keep any weapons or trouble at home if you prefer the back of your bike to a cop car. And although the traffic loop is no longer, there is a chute directing you from 37th to 25th Avenue South. Noise rules are still in effect, so avoid revving those engines and while everything kicks off and is in high gear today new spring church in myrtle beach they're having the annual blessing of the bikes starting at 11 and going to one tomorrow live in atlantic beach michaela evans wmbf news